Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Gold Prospecting at Home. This is episode number 140, and today I am so happy to get this video out of the way so I can delete these emails from these people. Look at this. Every single day I get another email from this mother load mining company, and these are some examples of the products. They're basically all the same. Um, I'm 99% sure that this is the same company as Golden Pay Dirt. And if you guys haven't seen my Golden Pay Dirt videos, um, you'll understand why I really am not a big fan of this. What I'm not expecting too much from this, to be honest. Um, let's go to the website real quick and I'll show you guys what is on there. So here's the website and it's set up basically the same way as Golden Pay Dirt. That's why I'm really suspect on this company. Um, they have five different products, it looks like. And right there, you can see the Purple Heart Pay Dirt. That is the one that I purchased. Um, when I purchased it, let's get the paperwork over here. It cost me $74.79. Um, that's because there is a $9.80 um, shipping and handling fee. So we're looking at $75 for this um, Purple Heart Pay Dirt. And um, it says that every um, purchase donates to veterans. So if you guys don't know, I'm a veteran. You can see my Airborne Creed right there. Um, and I have never seen a penny from this. So I'm just joking around. Um, I don't know. I buy all these things from a third party. Um, this one I actually, per I think I purchased this one. No, I didn't purchase it on Amazon. I, the reason I purchased this, I used a third party, but um, my dude here, Yatsoya, he sent a $100 super gift for, um, for something. And so I went ahead and purchased this Purple Heart Pay Dirt. So thanks, Yatsoya. If you guys um, don't know, I do have a Patreon. I do have channel memberships and everything. And yeah, I really appreciate all the support. Also, if you guys want a bag of my gold pay dirt from clutchgold.com, I'll be giving away a bag of gold strike pay dirt. There's a guaranteed half gram of gold in these bags. All you have to do is leave a comment, no two comments in a row. All of the details are in the description, so definitely read that before you enter so you don't disqualify yourself. Um, and also, while I'm promoting stuff, these um, old, let me show you. These old school logos here, these um, Clash logos with the pickaxes here. Um, my girlfriend is making them into tie dyes, and I think this is like the coolest shirt in the world. So if you guys want one, um, they'll be over on clashgold.com. And in the future, she plans on making her own website. And if that comes along, I'll link that below. But um, anyway, so again, I'm not expecting too much from this Purple Heart Pay Dirt. It's a, definitely a cool package. I mean, this, these jars are awesome. Um, it's probably my favorite kind of packaging. So, I mean, that's already a plus. But yeah, I mean, the, the daily emails are really what's getting to me. And I'm just so happy to get this video out of the way so I could finally unsubscribe to it. And uh, by the way, every one of these pay from this company, even though they are different prices, as you can see here, I'm pretty darn, they all have basically the same description. So I am, I mean, I'm 99% sure that all of them are gonna be exactly the same. So let's take this over to the panning station. We'll chop it open or we'll unscrew it open and we'll see what kind of gold we get. Okay, here it is, the Purple Heart Gold Pay Dirt from motherloadmining.com. Let's take a look at it in a pan. Perfect, all right, let's go ahead and rip this open. And like I said before, I really do, um, no matter how much I dislike the, the main company, uh, I really, look at that, even, it's even like, it's even got a freshness seal on it. I mean, that's actually really cool. I gotta give them that. Um, the material itself, it is not 100% play sand. I mean, it is sand, it's crushed quartz but it's a little bit darker than what you would find at like Home Depot. But it still looks like it's very easy to pan. It even has a little bit of moisture in it, I believe, unless it's just dark. It's hard to say with gloves on. It's not sticking to my gloves. But yeah, I don't see any round 
like river rocks or cobbles. That one's, I guess, maybe a little bit round. It's hard to say, and this stuff does come from Virginia. There's some round rocks. So it's hard to say. Virginia, there is gold, but is this where the gold comes from? I would highly doubt it. All right, so the first thing I wanna do is classify this stuff through a dollar store kitchen strainer, just to separate the big and small material. Shouldn't be too much, but if there's any nuggets or pickers, we'll see it right here. And just for funsies, I'm gonna go ahead and remove the magnetic material from the Minus kitchen strainer. I'm not hearing any magnetics coming up, maybe just a small amount. Yeah, there's not much at all. So it's not really worth even trying to remove it, but there's a little bit in there. We'll just leave it in the pan. Okay, here we have our plus and minus kitchen strainer size material. There's a little bit of magnetics that I left in here, but that's okay. I think we'll go ahead and pan the smaller minus kitchen strainer size material first, just in case there's any big nuggets. Uh, that'll be towards the second half of the video. So let's bring over Krusty Rusty. I'll add some water and some jet dry. If anybody knows what this is for, go ahead and leave it in the comments. So here we have a pretty decent amount. I could probably easily pan that off, but I think I'm gonna go ahead and just do it in maybe three separate pans. Just a little bit to start off. I'm not 100% sure that this is gonna be super easy, but just by looking at it, it's all blonde sands. But normally, just like play sand, it'll pan off very easily. So let's give it a try. Yep, it's panning right off. Like literally zero effort, just washing rocks here, washing sand. All right, let's pan it back. There's a couple flakes of gold in here. Yeah, there's actually way more than I expected. Look at that. First pan, probably a third, one third of the entire um, can or jar of pay dirt. We'll grab that with a snuffer bottle and we'll pan this one more time just to make sure I got everything. Yeah, and we're good. All right. So that actually wasn't too bad. We'll go ahead, we'll go ahead and pan another third of it. Again, it's very easy to pan off. No challenge really, it's just kinda, kinda boring to be honest. All right. After about 10 seconds of panning, we are down to the end and I can see two, three, four, five, 10, 20 more flakes. It's pretty good. I mean, for $74, I would expect, well, let's not say anything yet. We didn't get through the big stuff yet. And I think I missed a couple pieces here. Let's just pan it. Let's just pan it again and get the, the gold down to a corner. There's four pieces I missed. Right there. All right. All right, one more pan to go.
Again, to win that bag of gold pay dirt that I mentioned before, make sure you guys read the description. You can enter as many times as you want. Just make sure you don't comment twice in a row, because if you do, you will be disqualified. All right, we actually got some black sands here, and there's way more than what I left in the bag. Watch carefully as I pan this off. I don't know if you could tell, but this is pretty much all black sands, so I don't wanna be panning that off because it's possible there's gold in there, right? So we wanna bring it back and keep everything in the pan and just swirl it back. I think I have a little bit too much water. There we go. You're using the water as a tool to bring the, the dirt back to reveal anything that's hidden up above. So then once I get some cleaned off, I'll spray that off. Guys, if you want one of these squirt bottles, I highly recommend it. This is like the most important tool you never knew you needed. And then we just repeat that process, make quick work of this uh, pay dirt. And there's a couple more flakes right there. Not too bad at all. Okay, next we have the Plus Kitchen Strainer Size Material. I kind of pick through it just quickly just to see if there's any nuggets. Now this is a $74 bag, $75 bag of pay dirt. You would expect at least some pickers. I found one right here. Definitely a nice piece of gold. And there might be more in there. So let's go ahead and pan it out and get everything. It's panning off super easy, just like you would expect from pebbles of this size. Quartz, mostly quartz. And any gold is gonna be left at the bottom here. And I do see two or three pickers. Let's see what we got. And there's two pickers there and actually two small pieces of flower gold that I somehow missed. So there you go. Not too bad. All right, we'll go ahead and empty the snuffer bottle just to see everything in one pan. All right. Okay, well, see the first thing I'm thinking of now is how much I paid and the small amount of gold that I have here. It's definitely not the worst pay dirt I've ever gotten. Actually, by far, it's actually not terrible. I mean, but for $74, uh, it's hard to justify it almost, right? There's so many better pay dirt companies out there. Um, I don't know, it's, it kind of sits wrong with me. I'll go ahead and get every little speck of gold here. And I'm gonna grab every little speck of gold here and then we'll go ahead and clean this stuff up. We'll dry it out, weigh it up, and we'll get a value on it. Let's see what we got here. So 
I was actually very surprised and very happy to see that we got 0.524 grams of gold. Um, that's over a half gram. And honestly, I 100% honest, I thought I was gonna get maybe a 10th of a gram. So this is like five times better than what I thought we were gonna get. Um, we're also gonna call it 24 karat purity because if you didn't know, you can actually resell natural plaster gold just like this to pay dirt vendors like myself. If you guys have natural plaster gold and you wanna sell it to me, just go to kleshgold.com, click on the sell your gold uh, button. I'll send you a free quote and I'll buy your gold. So let's see what this is actually valued at. Today's gold spot price is $1,934 per troy ounce on today's date of September 18th, 2023. And yeah, $32.58, which is a little under a 50% ROI. Um, man, it's so, if this is Golden Pay Dirt, if it's the same company, they're, they're, they're doing something in the right direction. Now, the thing that really made me upset about this company was because they're selling all over eBay and Amazon and sending out spam emails to everybody just like this company. However, the gold that you would get from Golden Pay Dirt was just a small, small amount because they would guarantee no minimum amount of gold. They would just say you're guaranteed some gold and you would get like three or four little flakes. You'd spend, you know, 50, $60 on it. Then you're like, you know, it, it turns new people off of the hobby. That's really the thing that I didn't like about it. But this pay dirt, actually, I wouldn't be 100% disappointed. Um, it's definitely not the best one out there. For example, the gold strike pay dirt, this is only $50 and you're guaranteed over a half gram of gold. So that's just an example, but there's other pay dirt companies out there like that. So anyway, um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Again, make sure you read the, the entire description um, on how to enter for the free bag. Um, you don't wanna disqualify yourself. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you liked it, hit the thumbs up button. If you haven't subscribed, you know what to do. And I'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching. If you're still here, you're one of the 42% that actually watched the entire video. So thanks so much for that. It really helps the show. Also, huge thanks to all of my Patreon supporters and channel members scrolling right here. If you like this video, definitely consider subscribing, hitting the like button, and also checking out the video I have linked right over there. It's very relevant to what you just watched, and thanks for watching.